team. Happy Wednesday. Once again, a full lower body day coming our way today. Now, check it out for the warm up. We are jumping straight into it today. Warm up is going to consist of four total exercises, but two of them are the same. Okay, the way it's going to work is we're going to go for 40 seconds of air squats, followed by a 30 second squat hold. Then we're going to go into 45 seconds of high knees, and then we're going to drop for a 45 or a 30 second hold once again. Okay, we're going to see that full pattern two times today. So you're going to be holding that squat for a good portion of time, just getting the quads, getting those glutes ready, all of that good stuff ready to go. Okay, so I'm going to show you all of them, and then we're going to start the clock. So for the first one, making sure you guys got room on the air squat feet. Outside of those hips, core is tight, shoulders are back. We are dropping down 90 degrees, that knee, chest is back. 45 seconds of that. Second move, the hold. I need you guys to be holding nice and low, hands away from your knees. Next one on the high knees, we're gonna be right here. Opposite hand, opposite leg just for momentum. Here and here is your option. And then you guys drop and hold, same thing, okay? So, 15 seconds, we'll take up for the first one. Those air squats, nice and easy, nothing crazy. It is a good duration of time. So shake it out, get ready to go. We kick this Wednesday off in five, four, three, two, and one. Let's go. Down and away. Here and here. Good. Drive through those heels. Chest is back. Everything is good. 45 seconds, a good amount of time. Just to loosen everything up. Nothing crazy. And we're going to see this two times. So first round, just get used to the move. Waking up those legs. Here and here. Good, team. Next, you're more than halfway. You guys are giving me 15 more seconds. We got a hold coming. Now the hold is going to happen right after. There's no break before it. We drop and we hold. Last few reps. Here we go. Five, four, three, two, and one. We are holding at the bottom. Stay right there and hold. Everybody is holding down here with me. Keep it tight. Shoulders back. Knees out. Whatever you need to do. Good team. Just a little bit more. It's on only 30 second hold. We got 10 more seconds here. And we're out of it. Good. Last five. Four. Three. Two. And one. Bring it up. Shake it out. Woo. Shake it out. Shake it out. Shake it out. Good. High knees. 10 seconds. Second move. Same thing. 45 seconds of this. Have a good pace going. Get ready for it in five, four, three, two, and one. We're right here. Knee up. Option here and here. If you're taking that option, not a problem. I just need you guys, again, to create a good pattern, a good rhythm, something that you can hold on to for the duration of these 45 seconds. We're not trying to burn out on the first 20. Nice and light on your feet. If you're taking the option, make sure knee is still coming up. Still driving it to chest, opposite arm. Just for momentum, you guys got 15 more seconds. We're right there. We got a squat hold that's coming up right after this. Last couple reps. Five, four, three, two, and one. Shake it out. Feet outside those hips drop. Straight into it. Remember, no break until you finish this one. You gotta earn it after this 30 seconds. Good. Hands in front, hands above your head, wherever you need, as long as they're not hanging out right here on your knees. Chest is back. You guys got 10 more seconds. Stay with it. Good, I know it's shaking, but you're right there. Break is coming in five, four, three, two, and one. Nice, team, shake it out. We got 15 seconds right now. We're gonna go straight into round two, last round here. Air squats, 45. If you've seen it once, you're gonna see it again here. We make it happen one last time, follow it up with that hold. Get ready in five, four, three, two, and one. Drop and drive. No time to waste. Legs are a little bit more open now. Blood is flowing a little bit more. If you need to speed it up and you want to speed it up, go ahead and do so. Second round, now you know the motion. Last time you see those. Good. You're looking at 15 more seconds. We got that hold coming. It's right there. Good. Give me five. Four, three, two, and one. 
beautiful job. All right, shake it out. Hold is coming. Drop in three, two, and one. I'll let you shake that one out just a little bit more. Drop and hold, 30 seconds. Second to last hold, guys, we're right there. Second to last, remember, arm with friend, best option. On your hips if you really need, but not on your knees. Last 10 seconds, though. Stay with me. Good. We're looking at five, four, three, two, and one. Beautiful, bring it up, shake it out. 15 seconds, high knees. Last time we see those. 45 seconds coming our way. We end it big with one more hold at the end. Get ready for it in five, four, three, two, and one. We're on it. Again, pacing it. Still driving up. Good. Option is still on the table. Here and here. Still driving up with power. Good team. You got 35 more seconds. Excuse me. 25 more seconds. Halfway point. Good. Stay with those last reps. 15 seconds. Show me those last few. We're going to jump straight into that squat in five, four, three, two, and one. Take it down. Straight into it. No break on this one. Last 30 seconds. We end it. We go into a little bit of stretches. We're right there, though. Good. Nice and deep breaths. Control that breathing. I know heart rate is up, but you guys have the last 15 right here. Good. Stay with me. Last few for five, four, three, two, and one. Shake it out. Beautiful job. All right. Grab some water if you guys need it very, very quickly. We're going to go through just a couple of stretches, and then we'll move straight into our first workout. Okay? Catch your breathing. Again, heart rate, I know is up. First one, when you are ready to join me, taking those hips right underneath your hips, we're going to hinge back and reach for those toes. Try not to curve that back. So reach nice and straight. Come back to the top. Here and here. Again, join me when you're ready. You're here for 15 seconds all together. Down your way. Down up. We're opening up that lower back and also those hammies, the back of the leg. Pushing back, pushing back. Side bend in that knee. Last five, four, three, two, and one. Feet are going to be together. We got body twists. You're going to take those hands in front. Just twisting side to side. Look over that shoulder as you twist. Don't go crazy. Don't go too quick. Nice and easy. Ten seconds. Good. You're going to give me the last five. Four, three, two, and one. Next one is going to be those lateral lunges to open up that inner thigh. We're going to start with those feet together. You're going to step off to one side, leading into that leg. Other leg is straight. Meet back in the middle and switch here and here. Go ahead and join me when you are ready. We're here for 30 seconds, alternating sides. Again, pushing back, coming back together. Hold it if you need for that moment. Come back together. It's a stretch, nice and easy. Last 15. Good. Last few here. Give me the last five, four, Three, two, and one. Nice, last one. We're gonna go for those twist loaders. So you're gonna kick opposite hand, opposite leg in front, from the front, opposite hand, opposite toe. Try to make contact, go ahead and join me. 15 seconds, switching back and forth. If you need to take a step back, stepping forward, go ahead and do that. Up to however you wanna get it. You wanna make sure those kicks are nice and high, you're reaching those hips past it. Good, last five. Four, three, two, and one. Beautiful, guys. Go ahead and check it out. Take a moment. Grab some water. I'm going to go straight into uh, explaining workout number one. Give me just one sec. All right, team. Workout number one is going to be consisted of eight minutes. It's a short block just to get us going. You guys are going to have three exercises. Your lucky number is 20 for the first two. We're going to go for 20 sumo crab blocks. 
followed by um, curtsy lunges, 10 on each side, 20 total. And then dumbbell burpees, that's the only one that's gonna change to 10. So once again, those uh, sumo crab box for 20, curtsy lunges, and then you guys are gonna have those burpees for 10. Now, for the first sumo crab walk, I'm gonna give you the exercise and then I'm also gonna give you an option in case you guys have those mini bands at home. I know they have been requested, so if you have them, you can use them today. Only if you do, if you don't, there's, it, the exercise is still gonna work perfectly fine, okay? So, for the first one, on the crab walk, you guys are gonna load those dumbbells on top of those shoulders in this front rack position. From here, you're gonna start on one edge of your area in that slight bend position. You're gonna take one big step to one side. That's one, take it back to the other side. That's two, so every time you cross over, it's a rep. You guys got 20, so 10 on each side. If you're gonna take the option and you wanna use your bands today, bands are gonna go right above the ankle. If you wanna keep it low, it's not a high positioning. Same thing, dumbbells stack them on top. Big step, keep it low. Big step, keep it low. Okay, only if and if you wanna use them. Next move. You guys are gonna go straight into those curtsy lunges. Now for this one, dumbbells are gonna be next to a suitcase style. You're gonna take one leg behind you and dip. Like you're giving you that curtsy bow, you will come up and switch down and away. So I'm showing you from the side again. I'm gonna swing it behind me, drop, come back to the top. 10 on each side, last and final one. Dumbbell burpees, holding onto those dumbbells. Again, suitcase style right here. You're gonna come all the way down, chest hits the floor, come up, stand. Option on this one, come down, step out. As you drop, you'll step back in, you'll stand to the top, okay? Same motion. So, I'm gonna give you guys 20 seconds. Grab what you need. If you're pulling the band out, go ahead and grab it. If not, dumbbells up. Eight minutes, guys. Can we kick it off with eight minutes? As many rounds as you guys can do in those eight minutes, okay? Me, I'm gonna choose the option of the band today. Big steps. Here we go, 10 seconds. We're going from the gates. Get ready in five, four, three, two, and one. We're up. Again, dumbbells loaded. Squat position. One step to one side, one step to the other. That's already two. Keep it low, though. I don't want you guys up here and just stepping to the side. Every time you take that step, count it as one rep. You're gonna give me 20 to the top. Purpose of this one is getting it low and loaded. Feeling all that burn in the quads, all that good stuff. Good. Let those dumbbells just relax. Don't put too much thought into them. Here and here. Good team. Once you're done with those 20, you're gonna go into those curtsy lunges. Make sure you take the band off if you're using it. Good. On the curtsies, you got 10 on each side. Option if you want to do all 10 on the same, do it and then switch or alternate between the two. I'll let you guys have that today. Get together, drive back, dip down, come back together. Okay, take your time with these. Just like any other lunge, you want to make sure chest is back, shoulders are back and you're dropping straight down, not forward.
Nice, ladies. Looking good, team. Once you're back and you've taken that break, again, if you need it, if not, you can jump right into it. You're back to the top of those crab walks with or without the band. It's still going to be affected as long as you keep it low. Dumbbell stack them over. Option on this one. In case the dumbbells are too much, you use one dumbbell, flip it over onto your collarbone at the same front rack position. Okay? Still low. One big step. One big step. Okay? Chest is back. Hands are loaded. Get in here. Okay? Remember, don't lose it. Ten on each side. That's not five on each side. Give me all ten on each. Twenty to the top. Good. Once you guys reach that halfway point at the four minute mark, I will let you know. Making that second half just as good as that first half. Down the way. Good. Curtsies to finish that one. Ten on each. Good, there it is guys, four minutes. Four minutes in, four minutes to go. Again, same thing. We match that energy from the first half to the second half. Make it just as good, if not better. First workout is setting the pace for this one. It's setting the tone. Set that bar high for yourself here. Good team, down and away. Nice Paulette way to get to those burpees. At a girl. Next, we're on it. Janet staying strong, finishing off a full new set, girl. Here we go. Remember, after the burpees, just check in. If not, you jump straight into another set. On these eight minutes, on average, we're trying to see at least three sets or more here. Three full runs. See it three times, make that body accustomed to it. Three minutes left, team. Trying to 
30 on that clock. Here we go. Last 15. Every rep gets you closer to that break, but you gotta earn it. Get there, team. Nice. Last couple reps for five, four, three, two, and one. Call it, close it out. Time, time, time. Last rep. Done. Good job, team. Okay. Take a break. You guys have earned it. Grab some water, sip it, or shake it off, wipe it off. You guys are going to start. Enter. Workout number two. This one is going to be a little bit longer. We're looking at 10 minutes on the clock. We're going to have a buy-in exercise, though. Okay, remember your buy-in. You only do it one time. You're going to complete 30 step-ups to buy into this workout. Once you're done with those 30, you have three exercises. Your goal is to complete four rounds of those three. You're going to start with 12 RDLs followed by 12 pulsing lunges on each side, and then you're gonna have alternating reverse lunges for 12. We're gonna hit those lunges real hard in this round. Okay, again, four rounds of those three exercises. Let me show you all four exercises, and then I'll give you time to set up. So, for this one, you guys will need that step, a chair, a stool, something not so crazy, whatever you can physically step on top of and give you a little bit of elevation, okay? We are gonna do these loaded, so you're gonna grab both of your dumbbells, suitcase style right next to you, making sure your foot is safely on top of whatever you're stepping on, you will drive through the other foot, come back to the top, down, down, okay? 30 total, so you have 15 on each leg. Once you're done with those, you can take that bench, step whatever it is to the side, we're gonna go straight into your three moves. RDLs, dumbbells in front, palms facing you, shoulders back. We're gonna hinge back into those hips, slight bend in that knee, drive back up again, here and here. Your next one, on those pulsing lunges, I'm gonna show you from the side. We're gonna take that leg behind you. In that lunge position, you will drop into a full lunge, come up halfway from that lunge, right back down. So you're staying low for 12, and then you switch legs for another 12. Last one, reverse lunges, Shoulders back, same thing. This one you step back, drop all the way, come back together, and switch. You must alternate these. 12 on each side, so 24 to the top. Okay, guys? I know it's a lot. We're gonna get through it together. Do me a favor, 30 seconds right now. Grab what you need. Step, chair, stool, whatever it is that will give you some elevation to step on top of, have dumbbells ready. Once this clock starts, it's a 10 minute marker. Your goal is to get back down to those step ups and do buy out of those. 15 seconds. We're gonna start tall at the top. Good, get ready for it. Five, four, three, two, and one. Let's go to the top. Again, dumbbells to your side. 15 on each, either alternating or give me all 15 and then switch, as long as 30 happens at the top, B. Remember, one time, one time only, only step up, so just make it happen. Don't think too hard or long about them. At the top, make sure guys to take a moment here if you need. Depending on how high your chair is, make sure balance is always key up there. Good. Once you're done with your 30, take a moment. You're gonna go straight into your RDLs. Good. Remember on those RDLs, target muscle group, back of the leg, those hammies, all that good stuff. Try to push back into your hips as best as you can to achieve that stretch. So, feet together, pushing back, hinging back into your hips, drive back up again. Nice and tall at the top. That includes shoulders back, spine straight. Good, we're gonna hit 12 of these. 12 is your magic number for all three exercises coming over here. Nice team, once you get the hang of those RDLs, you can start speeding up just a little bit. That'd be crazy. Nice. From those pulsing lunges, coming away, stepping back, find it, dig that toe in. Remember, you're gonna come down all the way 
Once you're done, switch it up. Shake it out on that leg, of course. It's going to start to burn just a little bit. That's that good stuff. That's what we're here for. Switch it for 12 on the other. Good, team. From those, we got those alternating lunges. Again, going heavy on these lunges today, at least on this one. Stepping back, full range, come back together. Okay? As I always say, you're looking at an elevator, up and down only. Not that escalator, I don't want you leaning forward as you go down. You're in here. Good. Alternating the leg that goes back, 24 to the top. Even it out. This one's gonna take us a little bit longer to achieve on those 24, that's okay. Taking your time. It is a 12 minute, a 12 minute, 10 minute walk. Okay, you guys are already three and a half in. I will work for you. I'm up for you. How are we doing? Hanging in there with those lunges. I know it's a lot, guys, but we're hanging in strong. We're going to stay with it. Good, good, good. Round two, or once you're done with those, Round two, we go straight into the RDLs, guys. No more step ups. Step ups only happen one time. Straight into your RDLs. Second exercise. 12 is our magic number. Same thing, making sure that chest is back on those lunges, don't get caught up in making it quick. Yes, four rounds is our goal, but still looking at those quality reps, ensuring that we're getting the most out of it. Moving that body in the correct way. You guys are looking good though, staying strong with me. We're almost through this big block. With the 
last three minutes, don't lose sight of that fourth round. Fourth set to go. And don't count yourself out so quick. Don't get in the mentality of I'm not gonna finish. Why should I even try to go for it? You gotta keep it up. You've already made it this far, rest it out. As many as you can get in. As always, you guys are trying to make the most out of your time today. Every rep gets you closer to those goals, no matter how small it is. What you need to do.
your goal is to finish within that minute. That's all you have to remember right now. Okay? Do me a favor, guys. 20 seconds right now. Make sure everything is cleared out of your way. You just need those dumbbells for the first move. Okay? Just set yourself up for success. Once I start the clock, six minutes. Two different sets of exercises. We're going to do it for six minutes. So if you're doing the math correctly, you're going to see them three rounds a day. Okay? Here we go. Ten seconds. We start with those cleans first. The top. All right, guys. We kick off this first minute in five, four, three, two, and one. Quick clean, quick drop. It's on you to make it quick and earn your break. Once you're done with those 10, you're going to go straight into those jump squats. Dumbbells to the floor from that. Okay, body weight style. Good. Nice. Earn that break only when you finish. Everybody's moving at a different pace. Land softly in those jump squats still, using those legs to grab, catch some air. Option, remember, here, drive up. You guys got 20 seconds left before we enter minute two. Skaters, making sure path is clear. 15 seconds. Do what you need to do, whether you're finished or not. If you're done, take that break, 10 seconds. Get ready for it in five, four, three, two, and one. We go, you got 20, total 10. Cover some distance here. Option again, step back, step back, okay? Once you're done with those 20, go straight into your high knees. Don't hesitate. With an Iman, we can't think about it. Good. Take it out 30 seconds. You got 30 seconds to finish. If you're done, 30 second break. That's all yours. Round two, same thing. It's gonna come back to that. Remember, no breaks unless you get it. Catch your breathing, high knees are gonna get you. 20 seconds. Round two, now we know the move, especially with those cleans. 15 seconds. Good, get ready for it. Dumbbells up. We're moving. 10 dumbbell clean to squat in five, four, three, two, and one. Let's go. Drop and drive. Make it quick. On the clean, you can use a little bit of momentum, not too much. Don't go crazy with it to get it to a clean. Good. Last little bit. Remember, jump squats to finish. Good, you guys got 20 seconds. If you're done, you're done. Way to get there. Shake it all out. Second set, don't get started until I tell you. Skaters though, 15 seconds. Whether you take an option or you're doing it with me. Make it happen, athletes, 10 seconds. Good, we're on it. Three, two, and one. Let those legs cross and cross. Try to cover distance now. Nice. Once you're done, straight into your high knees. 20 total, only 10 on each one. Do what you need to do. Good, Melissa. Way to get there. Free stay strong. Janet, almost there. Couple more. Good, my pre. You guys, 20 seconds. Down and away. Round three, last and final round here. We close this one out big. We're on it. Dumbbells are coming up in 10 seconds. Earn your last little bit. Five, four, three, two, and one. Let's go. Quick 10. Good. 
Good, last few, last few, you're right there. Beautiful. Do it with me, stay with me. And jump squats. Good. Remember, Asha is still there, no jump. Still giving me that heel lift. Extend yourself along yourself. You guys got the last 20 seconds. We got one last set of those scanners and high knees, and we call it. Break is coming, it's right there. Catch your breathing now. Make sure you're good. 10 seconds. Don't get too comfortable on that break though. Here we go. Five, four, three, two, and one. We're on. Again, side to side, cover distance. Last time you see it, make it good. Make it your best so far. Try to get all 20 unbroken if you can. Step, step is still there, okay? Once you're done, straight into your high knees. If you need a quick shake, make it there. Stay with me. Good. If you're still working, you got 20 more seconds. Last 20, we call it. You're done. Grab some water. Way to get there, team. You've earned it. Validate all that good stuff. Last 10 seconds. My team at home, stay with me. Do what you need to do. Give me five, four, three, two, and one. Call it. Beautiful job, guys. Break. You've earned it. Six minutes short, but it's effective. Way to get it done. We're going to move straight into our last walk. We got a little bit of abs coming our way to finish off strong. And then we call this one. Okay, so this is how the first one is going to work. We are going to have three exercises. Uh, first round is 60 seconds, so a full minute. Second round is 45. Last round is only 30. Okay, so we're going to be here for a minute, or a little bit of time, but we're going to finish off with this one, okay? So, first one, we're going to be hitting those 60 seconds of sit-ups, followed by 60 seconds of bicycles, and then we're going to be finishing with 60 seconds of toe reaches. So all of them will be on the floor. So if you guys want to pull up a mat to do so, go ahead and do so. I'm going to adjust this bad boy down there. Okay. Uh, body knee for all of them, so you guys can put those dumbbells to the side. For the first one, team, we're going to be right on our backs. Feet are going to be down to the floor, 45 degrees. Heels are down. Now your fingertips, very lightly behind your ears, or you can have them right next to you. You will come up, shoulder blades, lower back, all the way off the floor. If you can't give me the full sit-up just yet, up front is fine. Halfway up, halfway down for 60. Okay? Your next one, on those bicycles. You guys are going to be right here. Feet are going to be extended out. Fingertips this time for sure. Lightly behind your ears. You're going to come up. Opposite elbow, opposite leg. Crunch in the middle. Extending the other leg across. Here and here. Option. Bring those feet up at 45 degrees. You're just going to crunch halfway across. Halfway across. Okay? Last one. Toe reaches. Legs are going to be straight up in the air. Reaching for those toes. Shoulder blades barely come off the floor on that one. Okay? Three big moves. We start with 60 seconds a piece. I will give you 10 second break in between though to get yourself ready for the next one. So let's go ahead and focus on that sit up first. We're on our backs. We kick it off in 10 seconds. Get yourself ready. Take your option. Here we go in five, four, three, two, and one. We're up. Nice and easy. Nothing crazy. I want you guys to be a full sit up if possible. Find what works for you. Okay, down and away, at the top, squeeze, everything is elongated at the top, sitting up proud, good, beautiful, you're looking at 30 more seconds, halfway through it team. Do what we need to do. Last 10. Stay with it, ladies. Stay with it. My three almost there. Good, Janet. Give me five, four, last few, three, two, and one. Beautiful. Right, shake it up. 10 seconds. Next one on those uh, bicycles. Fingertips again behind the ears. Legs are going to be off the floor as you crunch. Crunch. Okay, here we go. We're on our back in five, four, three, Two and one. Let's go. 
across and across. Try to touch that elbow to that knee. Option again. You're going to prop those feet up right here for me. Still taking that leg off the floor as you meet in the middle. Crunching diagonal here. Across, feel those obliques. Once you get the rhythm of it, you can speed it up a little bit more. Making sure the other leg is fully extended though. Don't leave it crunched in the middle. Don't get caught up in it. Good team, you're looking at the last 25 seconds. 10 second break is coming before we switch it. Longest rounds right here, let's get it done. Good team. You're looking at the last 10. Stay with it. Couple more, five, four, three, two, and one. Time, time, time. Take a moment, shake it off. 10 seconds, we go for those toe reaches. Remember, legs straight up in the air, reaching. Try to touch, option, drop those legs down 90 degrees, but you're still reaching up towards the ceiling. Here we go, five, four, three, two, and one. Legs straight and reach. Small contraction, again, shoulder blades barely are coming off the floor with this one. If you're dropping down, you're still keeping those heels nice and high, don't let them droop. Reaching up towards that ceiling, giving me that same range of motion. Team, last 30 seconds. You're right there. Good. Couple more, team. We're looking at 15. Long break is coming, I promise you. You gotta earn it though, with me. 10 seconds. Couple more legs together. Don't get sloppy with it. Five, four, three, two. And one, beautiful. Come up if you need it, you got 20 seconds right now. Second round, we're cutting it to 45, same thing. We got those sit-ups coming our way. You know the drill. We run it all over, we're just gonna cut it a little bit. Okay, so still making it work. 10 seconds will be your break after each one. Okay guys, 10 seconds, get ready on your back. We got those sit-ups once again. Here we go. In five, four, three, two, and one. Up and away. Here and here. Try to keep those feet still to the floor. We don't want to come up with those feet off the deck if possible. Good. Every rep gets us closer to that finish line. We're right there. A couple more rounds of this and we're out of it. Good. Last 15 seconds, just like that. You're gonna give me five, four, three, two, and one. Nice team, okay. Check it out, 10 seconds. Bicycles are coming our way. Same thing. We're gonna hit those for those 45. On our backs in five, four, three, two, and one. Let's go. Across and across. Again, first couple, find your rhythm with it. Then you guys can start to speed it up. Option is still there, you're gonna be right here. Same thing. Find the rhythm, speed it up once you get it. It's a quick motion. Try not to spend so much time out. Good, last 15 right here. I got that short break coming though. Good, a couple more reps. Stay with it for five, four, three, two, and one. Beautiful. 10 seconds, if you take the break down there, take it. If you stand up, take it, does not matter. Just take it. We're gonna hit those toe reaches for 45. Get ready for it in five, four, three, two, and one. You're up and away. Big break is coming after this. Finish these legs off strong. If you're dropping here, stay with it. Does not matter as long as you are moving. Keep it in motion, guys. We're so close to finishing this. Good. Show me those last 15 right here. 10 seconds. Couple more reps. Five, four, three, two, and one. There it is. All right, 20 seconds. Again, if you need to stand up, 
stand up, go ahead and do so. Last round, 30 seconds, and we call it. Still with that 10 second recovery in between, just to get, make sure that you are running all the way through. Quick though, quick. All right, team, we're out of here. Sit up, seven our way, one last time in five, four, three, two, and one, let's go, down and away. Attempting those full sit-ups, crunch is still there if you're doing the crunch, remember, same thing, fingertips lightly behind those ears, shoulder blades are the only thing that comes up though, okay? Still feeling that contraction, and that center up. 15 seconds though, that's it, we're out of this one. You kiss these goodbye for today. Good. Last few, you got five, four, three, two, and one. Time, beautiful. Shake it out, 10 seconds. Bicycles for 30, we're out of it. Short and sweet, guys, let's make it happen. Get ready in five, four, three, two, and one. Athletes, we're all nine o'clock. Last little bit. For this one, you wanna speed it up just a little notch. Nothing too crazy, but end it big. Option is still there, pop those feet up. You got the last 10 seconds, though. Do what you need to do. Couple reps for five, four, three, two, and one. Beautiful job. 10 seconds, take it right there. We got toe reaches and we're out of here. I'm just asking for 30 seconds out of that tank. We cross that finish line together. We're on this one in five, four, three, two, and one. Let's go to the top. 30 seconds of work, we're out of here. Good team. Good, halfway 15 more seconds. You are so close, every rep gets you closer to that finish line and that break. Let's get there together. Last five, four, three, two, and one. Time, 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 time. Beautiful job, guys. You're on it. If you guys can stick around for two more minutes, I got a quick stretch and some announcements coming your way. We're gonna stretch it up down on the floor. So if you guys are on the floor already and just wanna stay right there, stay right there. Let me just adjust something and I'll be right there with you guys. 